Hello everyone, this is me Sadia here and I'm back with the bonus lovelies. This reading is going to be for the sign of Capricorn. So let's see what is coming up for you guys for this read. Topic of the reading is what are his current feelings and thoughts about you? What is it uh, that your person is thinking about you? And uh, uh, if you are dealing with a masculine energy, then this reading is definitely going to help you know his current feelings and thoughts about you and the connection he has with you. So it is going to be a gender specified read. If you are, you know, a female or a male watching it, uh, you can, uh, and if you are dealing with a masculine energy, then this reading is something that is going to get you the insight around what is going on in your person's mind and heart about you and this connection. We will be taking messages from your person as well. Plus, we will also be uh, seeing some oracle guidance as well. So, yeah, stay tuned. And uh, before I dive into the read, let me remind you, it's a general read. It may, it may not resonate with everyone out there. So always pick the signs and messages which are resonating with you in your situation and leave the rest. For personal needs, you can always reach out to me on my email ID in the description box. You can also check out other services that I offer as well in the description box. So Capricorn, let's see whoever it is that you're dealing with. Let's see what is he currently feeling and thinking about you. Let's see. King of Wands. This person finds you very attractive. Um... This person finds you as somebody who is a uh, who is a perfect one, who is like you know, uh, look wise, etiquette wise, you are perfect, uh, ideal kind for for this person. Um, I feel like you know he has a lot of passion for you. He has a lot of excitement, and you know there is a lot of a uh, um, sexual pull as well that he has for you. Uh, he really looks forward to have a stable connection with you. He's a, he's a passionate one. He's a passionate one. Somebody who who would uh, who would uh, you know um, who would come with the uh, with something stable to offer. You know, maybe initially when you started off together, maybe maybe the connection was uh, pretty much sexual, or maybe there was a non committal attitude of your person, but. Um, Soon he realized that you are the one that he was seeking for. So I feel like you know this connection has a you know if it's a new connection maybe you will have to wait uh, for him to uh, start seeing you from a different angle. But um, yes, eventually I feel like you know he's going to see you uh, see his life partner in you. Let's see more cards here. Yes, ten of cups and ten of pentacles. Yes, he really wishes to have a stable connection with you. For some reasons maybe he believes that you are not ready for it. Maybe you don't want to commit to him. Um, maybe because of the past that you might have had with each other or, or maybe with the, with the past experiences and love maybe you are not giving much into this connection with him but that's what he's aiming for maybe he's the kind of person who is very hard to believe maybe the way he looks like maybe he's somebody who's very attractive somebody who's very handsome somebody who's very good looking somebody who's um, you know uh, somebody who's very attractive and you uh, you know um, you feel like maybe he's not trustable that way like you know you feel like maybe maybe he's a flirtatious person and you don't want a person like him but he does have true intentions for you at least now i don't know if, if it started off very flirtatious way or not but yes right now he's intending to have a future with you which he uh, he really see that uh, you fit in uh, the vision that he has for his future so um yeah let's see more cards here six of souls he believes that you know if you come into his life as his wife or as his uh, you know uh, uh, life partner uh, he uh, his life is going to settle down his life is going to be smooth his life is going to be very beautiful because there is this something that uh, made him feel so about you maybe you give him a homely feeling maybe you give him a vibe that um, that you are the one and only perfect one that he has ever seen or been with so I do see that, you know, he's definitely having a very um, beautiful uh, way, perspective around you right now. Um, he does, he is a very possessive kind of a person as well. I feel like, you know, whoever it is that you're dealing with, this person really um, might be having uh, some sort of um, addiction issues as well. Like, you know, maybe he's somebody who's very much possessive as well. But I feel like, you know, he's, uh, he's going to be a provider as well. I feel like, you know, he's going to be... Um, Somebody you will be very happy with because he's going to make you feel very special. Um, five of Wands and Ace of Pentacles. Right now, maybe he's kind of stressed to win your heart because uh, he really wants to have something stable with you. Maybe you are not trusting this person right now. 
I mean, today we do have four swords. I feel like you know, this person is unable to let you go out of, uh, uh, you know, is unable to kind of, you know, take you off his mind. So he does have a strong um, pull towards uh, taking things to the next level with you. But it seems like, you know, he's stressed because maybe you are not giving him the chance that he wants um, or he, he fears that you would not. Like, you know, maybe he's intending that and he's fearful that what if you don't give them, uh, you know, a chance around it. Maybe uh, he feels that you, you see him as a flirt person, as a person who is not trustable, as a person who's, uh, who had uh, been into many sexual relationships. But at the same time, um, he wants to be with you as well. Like, you know, uh, maybe he had been a certain him in the past, but right now he's not. He, he is very... Uh, Maybe he has changed, maybe he has evolved, now he's ready for a committed relationship and that's exactly what he's aiming to have with you. You are my sacred home to me. This person really likes you a lot. You know, this person really believes that you and your connection is sacred. I am finally realizing where I made a mistake. He might have a, you know, like I said earlier, maybe, maybe, he, um, maybe he gave you a wrong sign or signal with his certain non-committal attitude in the past and it is very hard for you to trust him again. But he's going to win that trust because he's, uh, he, he has a strong intention and a very pure intention too. When the time is right, we will be back together. So this person has a strong, strong faith in this connection. And he believes when the time is right, everything is going to fall into place. And you and him is going to be back together, having the kind of life that he truly desires. So yeah, let's see. Maybe he also believes that people are kind of, you know, feeding you against him. That could be the case for some of you as well. There, there is a, that energy coming as well with the Four of Swords especially. He believes that maybe you are influenced by other people. Maybe you, um, your person could have been a friend um, of uh, you know, your friend as well. So maybe you are finding it very hard to believe uh, his intentions. You feel like you know, he, he said that to her as well and now he's after me. So maybe I cannot really trust this person. So you might be having trust issues with him but he's uh, genuinely wishing to be with you. Um, a time to give rather than take. I feel like, you know, um, maybe you need to uh, give this person a chance. I feel like, you know, uh, let him win your heart. If he is genuine, he will make you sure that uh, he's, uh, he's up to get, uh, get you anything that you ask for in this connection uh, this time around. Uh, don't let pride get in your way. Now, don't be, don't be, um, don't be like, you know, um, don't ignore this person or their true uh, offer feeling uh, pride of uh, getting him back to you uh, or uh, being egoistic or something. Make sure you don't let that come in the way for the two of you. So yeah, that's pretty much it coming up for you for this read. If it helped you, do like, share and subscribe. And if you're willing to purchase a personal read, you can check the description box for that. Till I do the next reading for you guys. Take care and bye-bye.